If there is one thing that has distinguished the United States of America from the rest of the world, it is our unwavering belief in freedom. And if there is one thing that protects and upholds that freedom, it is the Constitution of the United States. We came here looking for a subject that we had an arrest warrant for. Obviously, we didn't find it. Patriot Act permits federal agents to write their own search warrants. Roving wiretaps without having to identify the person. Many Americans are being monitored. The FBI monitoring young children. Authorizes surveillance by suspicion, monitoring citizens not linked to any terrorist groups. I don't think the Patriot Act would have been passed if it would have been called repeal the Fourth Amendment Act. Fourth Amendment, gone. Do you want to have the government have the ability to send you to Guantanamo Bay? The National Defense Authorization Act gives the military the power to indefinitely detain American citizens without trial. Suspect it, not convicted. When they say, I want my lawyer, you tell them, shut up. Officially declares the United States a battleground. It designates the world as the battlefield, including the homeland. Sixth Amendment. Gone. There is absolutely never a reason to give up one ounce of freedom for the sake of security. It won't work. I, Barack Hussein Obama, will to the best of my ability preserve, protect, and defend the Constitution of the United States. So help me God. My administration will not authorize the indefinite military detention. President Obama, on New Year's Eve, signed the National Defense Authorization Act. No more national security letters to spy on citizens who are not suspected of a crime. President Obama signed into law a four-year extension of the Patriot Act. Drones! That Congress you love so much just passed a bill which the President is expected to sign into law. Drone air craft for use in American airspace by the year 2015. The agency officials say 30,000 of them by 2020. They can be used for surveillance to establish daily routine. From the moment that you walk out of your home in the morning until you return at night, your every movement will be tracked by this unseen eye in the sky. Governor Romney as president, would you have signed the National Defense Act? Yes, I would have, and I do believe that it's appropriate. I think you want to use every tool that you can possibly use. The Patriot Act has totally been a key part of that. All of us will be in danger for the rest of our lives. There is no such society that I'm aware of where we've had radical individualism and that it succeeds as a, as a culture. There is such a society. It's called the United States of America. This idea that people should be left alone, be able to do whatever they want to do. Government should keep our taxes down and keep our regulation full and that we shouldn't get involved in the bedroom. We shouldn't get involved in cultural issues. That is not how traditional conservatives view the world. They want you to believe that patriotism means that you support everything the government wants. A true patriot defends liberty and the people. Politicians are politicians, but Ron Paul is a human being, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. He's one of us, not one of them. And the people know that the system we have is not working. It's not working economically. It's not working monetarily. Our foreign policy is not working. And therefore, they're looking for answers. They will not welcome us with open arms. But there is a vacuum out there. And the vacuum is in not in one political party, it is pervasive. It's throughout the country, it is throughout the political system. Ideas spread, they can't stop them. An idea whose time has come cannot be stopped by any army or any government. Roots, people are beginning to realize that the problem is too much government. We need more personal liberty. Freedom is not something strange and neither is it ancient. It's recent. Tyranny is ancient. Don't give yourselves to these unnatural men. Soldiers, don't fight for slavery. Fight for liberty. Oh!